Hello, my name is Jeff Sharples uh, from CNC, and I'm here today with the latest strobe from Japan, the YSD2. Um, it takes all the positive points from the YSD1 and improves on a lot of things. The prime uh, point with the YSD2 is we now have an illuminated back screen so that in dim waters, cold in the dark, you can then see what settings you've got the strobe on. Um, we have different colours for different modes. The first mode is uh, manual with pre-flash. We've then got green for manual, no pre-flash. We've got the light blue for the, the DSTTL mode. That now allows us to um, adjust the EV settings plus and minus two, which is an improvement over the YSD1. It was plus and minus 1.5. Um, and we also now have two, um, the, the modeling light now has two power settings, which is 300 uh, lumens at high, 100 lumens at low. And we also have red filters that are supplied with the strobe so that uh, when you're taking pictures of creatures at night, we've got a red modeling light so that it won't disturb the, uh, your subject. We can also push and hold down the modeling light and then the color changes to dark blue and that now allows us to do the older um, DSTTL um, so that it's compatible with pretty much most cameras on the market. Another feature is that if we hold the, model, the modeling light down when we switch the strobe on, we go into a custom mode feature which means that we can then set the camera to four different custom modes for cameras that don't fit into any of the previous modes and that way the D2 is compatible with pretty much most cameras on the market. Um, you can find out more on uh, our website which is cnc.com.